And of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Assassin. And now we produce his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon. Lee! All right, the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out for You ready? Alright, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. It seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it all. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Big kick. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Ooh, what a punch. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Nice body kick. Unable to connect there. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth. This is a full-on brawl, DC. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Well, he's looking for that left hand just out of range, though, with it. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Lee. Right up the elbow. Body kick lands. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Three minutes and counting to go here in round one. Effective strike there by Lee. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. 
He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. And he landed the right hand there. Ooh, head kick Lance was hurt. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. There's the kick, it's blocked. That's a big strike right there. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. about that left kick to the body. Countering now with a hook shot to the body. That punch landed by Lee. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Let's get that chain down and win the round. And misses with the right hand. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, You've man. You got to check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Get you, get you. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Left hand counter. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Round two next. All right, no telestrator for the champ tonight, but that's okay. He'll still talk you through the replays. Body kicks for days, man. I mean, body kicks for days, but I got to be honest, John. If we don't incorporate a telestrator uh -huh. into this game, this may be my only version of EA UFC. All right, second round now underway. I'm no analyst, but a little bit of a feeling out process there in round one. And that's a part of being in the octagon with someone that's so skilled. You cannot just go after them guns are blazing. Both of these young men are trying to find the right moment to attack. Keep your hands up. Keep your hands up. I'm trying to kick the leg out. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big head kick lands. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. Slip and counter by Lee. Lands the double jab. Those are going to start to take their effect. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Head kick. And an uppercut. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Just out of range with that right hook. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, a huge block there. Look out for the uppercut. 
Just over three minutes now to go in round two. Nice kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Real quick leg. Oh, and he caught the kick. Punch over the top. Oh, a nice inside leg kick landed there by Lee. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Oh, and he lands yet another knee, and sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Came with inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Single collar tie now. He loaded up on that right hand too. Beautiful kick. That is a stiff job. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any spell when he's going to throw a knee. Missing on the high kick there. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Lee gets hit with a kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Look at the angle of that nice body. Oh, he connects there. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so the round is over, but not before damage was done. Cut on the cheek, sustained in that round. Cut man in there quickly as usual to try to seal it up. All right, some highlights for you now on that previous round, DC. Those body kicks were so good, I kind of felt like I got the wind knocked out of me from one of them. I have been on the receiving end on some nasty body kick, right? And all you want to do is start to carry your hands lower. The problem with that is the kicks start to look like they're going to go high. He's got to make an adjustment, change something, or this fight is going to continue to go down the same path. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Beautiful punch. Superman punch. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Big body kick lands. Watch knees to the body. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Big roundhouse now just misses. Oh, 
Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Big kick lands. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Straight punch lands. Lee's tough as it gets, but how about the size of that bruise starting to form on his right side? Just misses with the right hook. Big kick. Oh, and he lands a knee to the body now, DC. Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed to a knee to the body. It could in the night. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Whiffs on that offering. Oh, nice. Liver kick. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect, so fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land from anywhere. Oh, nice shot. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Big kick land. Oh, beautiful combination of kicks. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Right hand landed. Big leg kick land. Punch coming, it's blocked. Nice head kick. He loaded up there on that high kick. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Way to hide that leg kick. Goes back to that left kick once again. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Lee's hook to the body was blocked. Right idea, wrong execution. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Caught that. Now, there's danger in that, too, because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Oh, that's the quick score. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Bunches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. 
head kick. Oh, look at the redness underneath that left elbow. He is badgering that left side of the body. Right hook attempt, that's a miss. Oh, big head kick. Nice one, two there. Nice knee there, DC. Great job finding the opportunity to land that strike. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Beautiful body kick. Big kick lands. They continue to exchange. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Look at him whip his hip into that kid. And they separate. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Let your hands go. Let Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Beautiful body work land right under the elbow. Good series of strikes for him there. Staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Big body kick. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shin guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Once you get to take that many kicks, it doesn't matter if they're hard or not, those are a lot of kicks. Good stick. How about that shin? Under two minutes now to go. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, nice right hand. Hard shots landing on both sides here. He blocks the punch. Nice knee to the body there. Big leg kick lands. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. Oh, big head kick land. Came of inches right there, boy. It was a good night if that landed. Good punch. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, and he lands the front kick there. Not Anderson Silva versus Vitor Belfort, but a nice strike nonetheless. There are a lot of ways to land that strike. As you saw with Anderson, he took it up to his chin because normally it goes to the body. Oh, beautiful job by him there. Maybe the opponent was expecting the straight punch, and he goes to the hook. Mike Tyson used to have some of the best hooks in boxing, and this young man tonight is throwing him with that type of intensity. Nice. What's your first All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Here we go, fifth and final round. 
Nice kick. What a punch. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Oh, beautiful one-two punch. Big head kick lands. That strike blocked by Lee. Counter jab snaps the head back. That should get his attention. Clinch position. Beautiful elbow over the top. Oh. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Trying to establish that jab once again. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Under three minutes now to go round five. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. There you go. Look for the shot. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish, or he's going to lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's got to pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You got to just start letting everything fly. Right. Big punch land. Ooh. Lands to the body. Nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Two minutes now to go in this one. Gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliano is called to stop for this contest at three minutes, five seconds of round number five. To claim the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon.